What's up guys, it's Tarang and welcome back to the channel. And in this video, I decided to do something different. So with the new update with the new scopes and crosshairs pack that came out, they made the Gondhair Rifles 577-450 Black Powder Rounds ethical for Class 9 animals. And in this video, I'm going to be taking it out and hunting every Class 9 animal in the game. So we'll start here on Sunder Baton and hunt Tiger, Yak, and Water Buffalo. So without further ado, we're going to get right into it. Right, let's start off. Let's start with Bengal Tiger. Eight mythical here. Try to get a little bit closer. Oh, he is down. He is... That tiger is not getting back up. I can tell you that. Oh, we hit heart. That's why he went down so quickly. Still, that was a nice shot. It's nice to be able to use the Gondhair rifle on all the Class 9 species. Alright, that's one down. On to the next class 9 species. Uh, water buffalo on me. I'm gonna do just the sight. Alright. All right. These things go down quick. No problem getting through that water buffalo. Alright. After the water buffalo, I stopped commentating during the gameplay. But now it's time to take out the yak. So even though I hit it in the lung, it still had a low bleed rate, but it still was able to take it down without a problem. Even though it wasn't the best shot, but this video is not about making good shots on all the class 9 animals, it's just simply taking out one of each of the class 9 species. So now we travel on over to Verhonga Savanna in order to take out the Cape Buffalo and the Lion. And while I'm taking out the Cape Buffalo, I want to mention something. In this update, they patched it to where animals would spawn out of thin air if you exited a structure like a tripod. And that was the tactic I was using for grinding tar. It was a little cheesy. But honestly, I'm not mad they patched it. I had a feeling it was going to get patched. And to be fair, it was an exploit, so... But I feel like I'm just happy with the one great one tar, so... I probably won't be returning to the tar grind on Son of Baton anytime soon. And the developers have said they plan on backfilling tar on the Tiaroa, so when that happens, I'll be starting up my grind there. But anyways, back to the gameplay. As you can see, despite being up close, Gondor Rifle still had no problems taking out that Cape Buffalo with a double lung shot. Now, this is something that you could rarely to never get to happen with a 300. 
Of course, people are still going to use the 300 because of follow-up shots. But there are going to be a handful that will be carrying the Gante Rifle as a defense weapon against Buffalo. And now we move on to the King of the Jungle. Well, in this situation, the Queen of the Jungle. So I called in this Linus, and then shot her once with the Gante. And as you can see, double long, no problem. So that leaves us with three more Class 9 animals to go. The European Bison, the Plains Bison, and the Bantang. We're first going to start off by taking out the European Bison first. So unfortunately that first shot didn't get him all that good, but he did go aggressive. So I decided to use that opportunity to get another shot into him. Now he was in the water thinking that he was safe, but that was far from the truth. As you can see, we got both a double lung and double scapula shot into him. I'm really liking what I'm seeing here. That just leaves us with two more class 9 animals to go, the Bantang and the Plains Bison. As you can see we're over here on Emerald Coast and we're about to take out a nice sized Bantang. And while that I do want to talk about my plans for future Great One grinding. As you guys know I got Great One Moose number 13 a few days ago and it ended up being another duplicate. Which to be honest that's just how Great One grinding can go. You could either get a combo you never had or you can get another combo that you've already gotten previously. Even so, I'm still on that quest for the Fabled Oak. Once I get that fur type, I think I'm pretty much done with Moose. And then I'm probably going to move over to Fallow Deer to get some more great ones of that species. But back to the Banting, we did hit a Spine Shot, but we did take him out really easily. And that just leaves us with one more Class 9 species, the Plains Bison. And as you can see, we lined up that shot perfectly. And we once again get another double lung with the Gondier rifle. Anyways guys, that's going to wrap it up for this video. I know it wasn't that crazy. I decided to make this video since the Gondier rifle is ethical for class 9 species. But if you did enjoy, feel free to let me know in the comments below. Leave a like on the video, subscribe if you're new, check out the Discord server. Thank you guys for tuning in, and I will talk to you guys in the next one. Survivor.